The missing and disappeared submarine is owned by the company, Ocean Gate Expeditions, which is a privately owned company, and it is keen to make exploratory trips for foreign tourists who pay a lot of money to travel to places of ships, valleys, and underwater seas, as a kind of adventure and exploration. As it is one of the companies capable to provide manned submarines equipped with a lot of equipment for commercial projects, tourism, and scientific research. There were five rich passengers on board the submarine who embarked on an exploratory tourist trip, the value of the trip amounted to 250,000 US dollars to go to visit the wreck of the Titanic, and here are the names of the passengers of the 2023 Titan submersible incident, and they are as follows. British billionaire Hamish Harding is 58 years old. French explorer Paul-Henri Narglet, 77 years old. The CEO of the company that owns the submarine, Ocean Jet Expeditions, is Rush Stockton. Businessman of Pakistani origin, Shahzada Dawood, 48 years old. And his son Suleiman, both British citizens, who is 19 years old. It is worth noting that the famous wreck of the Titanic, which was visited by the five missing passengers on the Titan submarine, hit an iceberg on its first cruise in the year 1912 and then sank, at a depth of 3,810 meters and approximately 1450 kilometers east of Cape Cod in Massachusetts, USA, and 644 kilometers south of St. John's in Newfoundland province on the Canadian coast. Eric Fussell, associate professor and director of the University of Adelaide Shipbuilding Centre, described several possible scenarios, including power failure, fire, flood, or entanglement. He said a fire could cripple a ship's systems or create toxic fumes that could render the crew unconscious. The flood would be much more dramatic, leading to an almost instantaneous implosion. The most optimistic scenario, Fussell said, is a loss of power that allows the ship to return to the surface, where search crews are waiting to find it. According to the Daily Mail newspaper, the oxygen in the dive will suffice until Thursday morning, 11 a.m. Greenwich Mean Time, 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Do you think the Titanic curse befell them? Write to me your opinion in the comments. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the bell button.